Hey, everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we have a special treat for you, as we dive into the top 5 curiosities about the incredibly talented Brendan Fraser. But before we get started, do us a favor and hit that subscribe button and turn on the notifications, so you don't miss any of our future videos. And if you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Now, let's dive in. Curiosity number 1. First, let's take a look at Brendan Fraser's early life and career. Born on December 3, 1968, in Indianapolis, Indiana. Brendan grew up traveling the world with his family due to his father's job as a Canadian Foreign Service officer. This unique upbringing exposed him to various cultures and languages, helping shape him into the versatile actor he is today. Brendan started his acting career in the early 1990s, and after a few minor roles, he landed his breakthrough role as the lovable caveman in the 1992 film, Encino Man. Since then, Brendan has starred in various films, including the popular, Mummy, franchise and critically acclaimed movies like, Gods and Monsters, and, Crash. Curiosity number 2. Brendan Fraser is known for his unique acting style, which often incorporates both physical comedy and dramatic elements. His ability to switch effortlessly between these two styles has earned him a reputation as a versatile actor. For example, in the Mummy franchise, Brendan showcases his talent for action and adventure, while in movies like Gods and Monsters, he displays his acting chops in more serious, dramatic roles. This versatility has allowed him to work in various genres, from comedies like George of the Jungle to thrillers like The Quiet American. Curiosity number 3. In addition to his on-screen acting, Brendan Fraser has lent his voice to several animated projects. Some of his notable voice acting roles include playing the lead character in the animated film, Dudley Do Right, and providing the voice for Tasmanian Devil in the 2014 film, Looney Tunes, Back in Action. Brendan's unique voice and exceptional acting skills have made him a sought-after talent in the world of animation. Curiosity number 4. Brendan Fraser is known for keeping his personal life relatively private, but we do know that he was married to actress Afton Smith from 1998 to 2007, and they have three children together. In addition to his work in the entertainment industry, Brendan is also dedicated to giving back to the community. He has been involved in several charitable organizations and has worked to raise awareness and funds for various causes, including the fight against cancer and support for the arts. Curiosity number 5. Brendan Fraser's remarkable comeback has reached new heights with his recent Oscar win. After 12 years without a major lead role, Fraser was nominated for and won the Best Actor Award at the Oscars for his outstanding performance in The Whale. With this incredible accomplishment under his belt, Brendan Fraser's future in the entertainment industry looks brighter than ever, and fans eagerly await his upcoming projects. So there you have it folks, our updated top 5 curiosities about Brendan Fraser, including his impressive Oscar win for his role in The Whale. We hope you enjoyed discovering more about this talented and versatile actor, and we're excited to see what the future holds for him. If you have any other interesting facts or stories about Brendan, feel free to share them in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so you won't miss any of our upcoming content. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.